Hey guys, and welcome back to another how-to tutorial. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make this really awesome walk-in closet that you can actually put your armor inside. So guys, stay tuned and I'm gonna show you how you can make it. Right guys, to make this really awesome walk-in closet, we are going to need all the blocks that you can see right in front of me. We are going to need spruce planks, oak logs, quartz blocks, tripwire hooks, dark oak stairs, end rods, iron trap doors, banners, and armor stands. Now, once you have all of these blocks, guys, we then need to find an area of where we want to place our walk-in closet. Now, obviously I have a bedroom right here and this is a perfect place to put it. Now, once you have the area of where you want to build your walk-in closet, you need to knock out an area like this, which is a doorway to the closet. Then once we've knocked out that area, we need to start building the floor for the closet. So what we're going to do, we're going to get our spruce planks and we're going to build a five by five square with this block in the middle being the center. So this is going to be the center and we're going to make a five by five square so we're going to put two on this side and two on this side and as you can see right there that is five and now we're going to go four more in this direction so one two three four so there we go that is a five by five square so what we need to do now is basically fill up this area right here and then we have the floor for our walk-in closet so once we have done that what we need to do next is grab our oak wood and we need to place six pieces of oak wood in each one of the corners so we're going to place one here so one two three four five six like this and we're going to do the same on this side as well so one two three four five six and then do the same in the last two corners as well one two three four five six and then one, two, three, four, five, six, like that. Now what we're going to do is grab our quartz blocks and at the back of this area right here, we're gonna build up with quartz blocks. It's gonna be the same height as the logs we just placed down. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and build up this either side of the walk-in closet right here. So I've done that side and I'm gonna do this side as well. I'm gonna build it up six blocks until we get to the top of the oak wood. And then finally, I am going to do this side uh, over here and then we should be done with the side walls so as you can see we've started marking out the frame for our walk-in closet so next what we're going to do is grab ourselves some dark oak stairs and we're going to place upside down dark oak stairs on the bottom of each one of these walls so we're going to play one two three like this one two three and one two three just like that next what we're going to do is we're going to grab our iron trap doors and we're going to place upside down iron trap doors on this block right here so it's two blocks above the stairs that we just placed down so place it right there and place three across like this do it on each side like this so as you can see right now what we're doing we're making the shelving for the walk-in closet then finally what we're going to do is add some decoration around the top of this area right here we're going to add an upside down stair there and an upside down stair there then an upside down stair in the middle and then turn it either side like that so we've just got this little nice detail at the top and we're going to do this on each side so two upside down stairs then another one there and then one in the middle and then do finally on this side two upside down stairs one one above above it and then one in the middle right there so as you can see guys we've got all the details done for our walk-in closet so what it's time now to do is to put some clothes inside of our closet now there is a few ways we can actually do this and i'm going to show you three different ways you can actually put clothes inside of your closet so the first thing we're going to do we're going to start on this side over here and we're going to grab ourselves an end rod and we're going to put end rods across this top half right here then we're going to grab ourselves some banners and we're going to put three banners on this stair block right here and as you can see it looks like the banners are hanging on the end rods and it looks like some clothes hanging up in the closet so this is one way you can decorate your closet now there is a second way we can decorate our closet and we're going to do it on this side right here now for this one we might need to break some of these blocks right here but what we're going to do is we're going to place three armor stands on top of these iron trap doors so you might need to break your blocks right there and just place your armor stands down like this now underneath the armor stands what we're going to do is get three trip wire hooks and place them right here next what we're going to do is is break the iron doors and let the armor stands drop on top of the tripwire hook so it looks like the tripwire hooks are holding onto the armor stands and actually hanging on the tripwire hooks which looks really really cool now we need to repair this and put our iron trap doors back and put our stairs back as well so we have that nice detail there too so what we can do now is actually put some armor on these armor stands so it looks like we have some clothes inside of our closet as well so we have two different styles here guys we have the style with the banners and we have the style right here with some armor stands and some tripwire hooks which looks really cool as well so let's put the armor on these ones 
Now the final way that you can actually decorate your walk-in closet is with command blocks. So sadly, this means it's only available for PC, but if you don't have PC version, you can do these other two versions over here. But with the command blocks, first off, we need to give ourselves a command block. So we need to type this command in chat, and that is slash give, then your Minecraft name, then type C-O-M-M, press tab, press enter, and that will give you a command block. Once you have a command block, we need to place down three command blocks right here like that. Then above these command blocks, what we need to do is grab our end rods and place our end rods above them like this. So what we're going to do now, we're going to summon three invisible armor stands so it looks like we're actually hanging our clothes on the rail. So what we need to do now is go to the description down below guys and paste in the command in each one of these command blocks. Now this command is right here and it will be down in the description. Whatever direction you are facing, make sure to read the title in the description. It will face it will say facing north, east, south or west and you need to get the command for what direction you are facing. So get your command, paste it inside of the command block and you need to paste it in each one of these command blocks just like this. And then once you have done that, what we then need to do is grab a redstone block and just power each one of these command blocks like this so as you can see nothing is there right now that is because we have summoned some invisible armor stands now we need to destroy all of these blocks and what we can do now is grab our, our armor and right click in that area and as you can see we have some really cool armor that looks like it's actually hanging on the rails and also what we can do guys if you have some boots as well you can put boots at the bottom and it looks like the boots are sitting on the shelf so i'm going to put the boots right there and look at that guys how cool does that look it looks like the boots are on the shelf and the chest plates are hanging on the rail so right there guys we have three different ways you can decorate a walk-in closet we have a way with armor stands and tripwire hooks we have a way with banners and if you have access to command blocks we also have a way to decorate it with command blocks as well and if you want to guys finally what you can do is grab yourself a custom head or something like that and it could be any kind of custom head that you want and you can place custom heads on top of these iron trap doors as well just to decorate it some more if that's what you want to do but guys there we are are a really simple walk-in closet that you can put in any of your houses just to add that nice extra touch but guys if you enjoyed this tutorial today and you want to see more just like this and you never want to miss an upload from me all you need to do is click on the little bell symbol next to the subscribe button and you will be notified every time I upload a brand new tutorial but thank you so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed it and I will see you again in another how-to tutorial